My name is Wyatt. I'm a travel and lifestyle photographer, and this is the Costa Rica story. I came to Costa Rica with one very important mission to tell the story of the Footprint Foundation and its leader, Christine Figener. She is a world famous marine biologist specializing in sea turtle conservation. You may have seen her viral video removing a plastic straw from a sea turtle's nose. It's really hard to watch and you don't have to, but it did a really good job of highlighting a big problem, humanity's toxic relationship with plastic. Hi, what's up guys? I want to show you where I'm staying. This is where I'm staying in Gandoka, Costa Rica. I have one of the nicer houses that actually has a porch, windows. There's Chris on one of our Zoom calls. I gotta be quiet. And there's Butas. He follows me everywhere. So right now we're at Gandoka Beach doing a typical cleanup, trying to find an area that has recently experienced a lot of washed on plastics and just taking all the plastic off the beach and later on sorting it, trying to identify the different brands that have contributed to all of this and then sort it by what can be recycled and what needs to be burned. Fun fact, this little house here, we sell ice cream. It's super good, refreshing. So we're getting fun facts about sloths. <laughs> the other fun fact about sloths is they only poop about once a week. So they kind of climb down the tree to poop and that's the only time they really climb down the tree. Poop, exactly, well, I mean the theory is they poop where they usually eat so they kind of fertilize the tree and then they go up again. They have such a slow metabolism now, only once a week. Wow, don't try that at home. This project was located in the Gindoka Manzanillo Wildlife Refuge, popular nesting beaches for green and hawksbill sea turtles. As my time here in Costa Rica comes to an end, I reflect on the ironic fact that after an entire month, we didn't see a single sea turtle. Yeah, crazy, right? Christine said that this time of year, they usually expect two to three nestings a night. So what's up with that? Well, perhaps this tells the story I came here to tell even better than I could, that sea turtles are endangered. Their behavior around the world is shifting and it's so important for us to get involved with people like the Footprint Foundation to get some eyes and ears on this very big problem. Imagine a world without sea turtles. I don't think I can, so let's do something about it. <laughs>